Bonjour Sismic. And welcome to the Sismic Cafe, the show where we discuss what you are discussing. I am your host, Ven Ven, and today we will be talking about love. Oh, love. Love is a sunset never watched alone. Love is a fire that burns when we pee. Love is a hot dog tree for us to relish. But how can we find love in the modern age? For many people who are fed up with the single scene, online dating is the best option. So I thought I would give it a shot. Okay, let's see. Age, 29, weight, 175 pounds, height, 6 feet 2 inches. <laughs> what? What? Sex, usually in the morning, it's good. Religion, job, education, how many questions are on this thing? Over 200, okay, forget it. Actually, I must confess, uh, I once tried internet dating years ago. Yeah, I asked for a 26-year-old with good teeth. <gasps> they must have gotten confused. They gave me a 62-year-old with felt teeth. It wouldn't have been so bad, but she turned out to be my third grade teacher. And uh, the date ended when she gave me a B minus in uh, kissing. Hey! Giselle. Hi. Hi. How are you? I'm good. How I'm are good. you? Have you ever tried online dating? Yeah, one time. Did you have any luck? Yeah, that's that's where I met my stalker. Oh. I'm just kidding. How do people react on Sismic about this uh, this topic? Uh, what do they think about love online? There's a common sentiment that you can find love anywhere and everywhere. Yeah. But not everybody agrees. So we'll see what they think. Okay. Can you find love online? Well, that's a good question. I was rejected by eHarmony. After I filled out the, you know, 600 word survey thing, it was like, sorry Critter, we couldn't match you up with any of the millions of people in our database. Love is a process of, of the heart, not process of servers. I, I don't think you can find love online. I am actually in love with seven people on Seismic. I absolutely do believe that you can find love online. My mom and my stepdad have been together for six years and they met online. I believe you can find real love online because I met my husband online. I was playing a multi-user dungeon named Mud. He was a wizard and I was a regular player. We met in Mud and we've been married for 14 years. I think that you have as good a chances finding true love real love online as you do in real life. Can't you just Google it? Yeah, yes, you know about Fizz and I. Yeah, we fell in love uh, in 140 characters or less. We actually met on met through Twitter. So uh, yeah, of course you can find love online. But what a silly question. Um, you just have to find uh, a like-minded soul. Hopefully Fizz will reply to this as well. Of course you can. Can you find it in the grocery store? Of course. Can you find it wandering through the forest? Of course. You can find love anywhere. Definitely, definitely, definitely. The last relationship I had, well, I went on a date with this guy that, well, from online website. I don't remember where it was from, but all he cared about was perfect teeth and 26 years old. Perfect teeth. That's all he cared about. And it broke my heart. That's online love for you. Can love be found online? Let's ask an expert what she thinks. Our guest today has been happily married for 41 years, so I think she knows a thing or two about romance. Please help me welcome Frida Walden to the studio. Hello, Vendin. Give me your secret, Frida. How can you live 41 years with the same man, please? It's, it's so difficult for me. You know, I, I am married. What's, what's your secret? Here's the secret. One of you needs to work swing shift. And you still love him? Oh, absolutely. I love him with my heart and soul. It's too late anyway. No, yeah, I, I, it's right. Yeah, it's too late anyway. I think I, I, I like to give you some, maybe some advice though. And now you men, especially you men, you, you might want to think that you should show them your woody. 
you know, uh, you know, it's not a good idea. I would advise against showing your Woody because, you know, women don't really want to see your Woody. Are you sure they, of that? I know, really I, know, kinda, I know many women who want to see Woody's. I think we should take a poll, or maybe on Seismic, we should say how many women really like looking at your Woody's. Okay. Thank you, Frida, for this advice. I, I heard that you have a kind of love song. Yes, I do. A secret, another May secret. I sing it to you? Oh, and if you love me online, don't show me that. And if you love me online, just show me. Wait, wait, wait. Wait. These. Of course. <laughs> oh my God, he lost his tongue. <laughs> <laughs> I love you online, and, and I thank and I thank you very much. Thank you. I would have a problem if I fell in love. Yeah. I would fall in love again with a Frenchman. Oh. I'm telling you, Frenchman. Yeah. If a Frenchman showed up on my door, I'd get a divorce. But don't, no. don't tell. I'm, no, no I'm, I'm just kidding. I come. I'm just I, kidding. I come. Thank you, oh. Frida. Hey, goodbye, Frida. Thank you very much. Bye, Vincent. See you Thanks soon. for having me. See you soon. I love you online. Love. What a big uh, issue. Yeah. What do you think about that, Adam, love online and things like that? Uh, computer dating? Yeah. Mm, I, I, try, I tried it once. Uh, but uh, I got a computer virus. Hey, it's <clears throat> no, um, no, I like that. I like this one. Uh, yeah, seriously, um, I don't know. I think the real question that we have to ask ourselves yeah. is can we trust computers with our romantic lives?